Welcome to another one of my tutorials. Uh, today I will be showing you how to make like a fade effect in Visual Basic. Here's an example of what your program will look like when you're done. Notice how it fades in beautifully as the program loads and when the program ends it fades out as well. Here's how we're going to start. We're going to start by you're going to come over here to Solution Explorer, right click that and click Add. You're going to come over here to module, and I went ahead and did this whole thing so I could show you as I do. You're going to go ahead and click create a new module. I named it Fade Effect. It doesn't really matter where you named it. All right. <clears throat> Once you have a new module, you're going to come over here and go to it. Uh, you're going to create a new public sub, and it's going to be called Fade In right here. And then you're going to dim fade as a double for fade equals 0, 0.0 to 1.1 now what that's saying is you're gonna be fading until fade equals 1.1 and you're gonna be going by your by point twos uh... then you're gonna come over here form dot opacity form one dot opacity equals fade form one dot refresh threading dot thread dot sleep 100 and then automatically you should be putting a next in. All right. So now you have your module one set in for fade in effect. Now you're going to double click your module and then you're just going to put fade in with parentheses right after it. That's telling it it's going to run when it loads. It's going to run this. All right. And then we're going to start on how you fade out you're gonna do pretty much the same thing as before <clears throat> you're gonna come over your public public sub fade out dim fade is double again for fade equals 1.1 to 0, 0.0 this is the most important part because this changes step make sure make sure that step is negative 0.3, 0 0.3 that is very crucial that you have that uh, then you're gonna come over here have the same things except for form one dot opacity equals fade form one dot refresh threading dot thread dot sleep 100 and then next and then in sub in module and then that it will complete the tutorial you should have a great fade in beautiful fade in if you want to change the speed of the fade in like let's say I want to make it faster you just like change that step number instead of having it point 0.2 I'll have it point 0.4 so now it'll fade in a little bit faster if I want to go slower you're gonna go point 0.1 and then debug it and it'll go a little bit slower